Assalamualaikum. Uh, first, I want to introduce myself. My name is Zeta Dini Dayati, and my uh, and my friends call me Zeta. And now I want to story about my experience. Uh, no, my observation experience in competency assessment in semester one so keep on watching and let's start one day it was till the beginning of semester one i got a competency assessment the, the text request me and my group to do observation at a manufacturing at a manufacturing company uh, had, that has a warehouse for me and my friend who had graduated from senior high school of course the text is difficult for us we don't know where to start this and I'm feel so stressed in this moment finally we we find company that we can do to observation the company is Eureka logistic company uh, the location is it in Chiracas as Jakarta and and after we find the company we are so uh, we feel so happy and it was this day, uh, September 70, 2019, me and my group went to Eureka Logistics Company to do observation. But I don't know why in this Eureka Logistics Company, the security is quite tight. Um, we come there nine people only three people uh, allow it into the office and another and and the others are waiting outside of company precisely outside the route and at the time the weather quite hot I really don't like this moment because do you know if the weather so hot and you're outside of the route so many pollution in this route and I don't like it really and finally we waited uh, for one hour three of my friends who had interview with the manager um, we take a picture together for documentation and the first observation is complete yeah uh, first observation and then we go back to the home and start compiling and the observation report at the time before mid exam me uh, we were to presentation the company profile and supply chain of the company before the before the presentation me and my group study very hard in order to be able to answer questions that will ask by lecture. During the presentation, the lecturer called one of my friends to explain Eureka Logistics Company. And after he explained Eureka Logistics Company, the, my lecturer told my group have to change company because the document we got from Eureka Logistics Company uh, very few and because logistic uh, because uh, Eureka Logistics Company are not manufacturing company uh, but are more uh, inclined to company providing 
logistic service. And after the presentation, we will have to find a new company, start everything for beginning, and was very frustrating. Yeah, me and my group very frustrating in this moment. But fortunately, I have a good group. We encourage each other until we find a new company. Uh, the new company is Majibakti Prasindo. <laughs> it's, a, it's a company. Uh, Majibakti Prasindo is uh, the company man, uh, printing packaging and the location in Cikara. <laughs> and then on November 5, 2019, me and my group went to Majubakti Prasindo and we met Mr. Karin as a Human Research Department or HRD of Majubakti Prasindo. Then Mrs. Uh, and Mrs. Uh, Mrs. Karin told me uh, to enter the meeting room and there we talk uh, and talk and explain or propose to do observation in Meju Bhakti Prasindu companies. We talk um, until five or ten minutes. We we talk and interview Mrs. Karin about the department department in Meju Bhakti Logistics. After we explained our plain uh, observation to Mrs. Karin, Mrs. Karin called Mrs. Joko from shipping transportation, uh, shipping department, and we talk. We talk to Mrs. Joko about uh, about shipping consolidation and what mode transportation uh, of. Uh, what mode of transportation Majibakti Prasindo and shipping goods to customer and after we talking with Mrs. Joko, Mrs. Karin called Mrs. Rara from purchasing department and we we talk with Mrs. Rara uh, about we asked about question we asked a lot of questions about supplier and customer Majibakti Prasindo and uh, what what the, the Majibakti Prasindo criteria for supplier and each other. Nonetheless, uh, Mrs. Karin called Mr. Noto from department uh, from warehouse department and we asked and we asked Mr. Noto about what document use in the warehouse, uh, what uh, good in the warehouse Majibakti Prasindo, and what material handling tools used in by Majibakti Prasindo warehouse. And I think Mr. Noto is a good person because he wants to answer in the detail of the question, all of the questions we ask, and so and so we get complete information and data from Mr. Otto. We did interview at Majibakti Prasindo for two hours and after that we were to asking permission uh, to go back home and because it was a lovely evening but before before we go back home we take a picture together for documentation and the conclusion of uh, the assignment the competency assignment in this moment of uh, in this time, we got a lot of new knowledge and new experience, and it, it's good for me and for my groups. So, yeah.
Thank you for watching. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.